Okay, hey kids, here we go. We're gonna get the instruments going and here's my instrument. What? You think this is the instrument? This isn't the instrument? It's the instrument because I can tell you this. I'm gonna hold up an instrument. Yamaha trombone here. And I'm gonna tell you this. Here's my instrument. What I play here is going to be amplified here. If I do a good sound here, I'm gonna get a good sound here. If I do a bad sound here, bad news, okay? So here's the deal, guys. You have to get a good sound on your mouthpiece first. Once you get that locked in, you're gonna be fine and you'll be ready for the instrument. It might take a day, it might take two days. I've had kids take a week, but you know what? You have to have a good sound here because it makes a difference. I'm gonna play a note on a horn here. Now, that's a pretty good sound. Here it is, but I'm gonna take the mouthpiece out as I go. You'll see where it's made. There's the sound. I'm gonna do a bad sound. Here we go. You'll, what'd I say? This thing amplifies whatever I play in here. This is the amplifier of it. Good sound. Good sound, bad sound, bad sound. So we have to get the mechanics of the mouthpiece. Brass players, this is specific for you. I want you to do this. I want you to say the word two. Go two, do it now, two. And put your hand on your face here. Feel your face, the structure of your, the sides of your face here. You're gonna feel no tension. Here we go together, ready? Two, two. And your lips go out a little bit, ooh, and they're round right in the middle, two. Now, I want you to try this. I want you, uh, well, okay, I'm a Canadian. I'm gonna do O Canada on my lips. And my lips have to touch to buzz because here's the sound. Now, we don't normally walk around doing that going, I want you to do it. You ready? Try it. You notice I'm not going like this. It's not that, okay? I'm gonna do O Canada. I'm from Canada. Actually, I'll do both anthems if you're from America as well. Here we go, Canadian anthem. American anthem. I'm not trying to high note, okay? You get the deal here, guys. Try that. It's what you're doing into the mouthpiece. Now I want you to do this. Turn to a person near you. And I'm gonna have you drop your lower jaw. Keep it down. Look at them. Okay, try not to laugh while you're doing it. Look at them. And I want you, with your jaw down, make your top and bottom lip buzz. Okay, here we go. Ugh. It doesn't work so good, does it? Okay, plus, I gotta say, if somebody walked into your class right then and you're all like, oh, they might be thinking something different about this class. But it's just to show you, you cannot buzz without that. Now go back to that T-O-O face. Two, your top and bottom lip aren't touching. So that's not gonna work. Now, we're gonna talk about your eyes. Your eyes are critical in this whole thing. I want you to look up in front of you up about the six foot level. Pick a spot on the wall, six foot away. I'm gonna do that here. And you'll see this, I'm sitting like I'm gonna stand up. I could stand up right now, my feet are flat on the floor. Back of my chair does not exist. I could stand up right now, but I'm not. And I'm looking at about the six foot level. My eyes are staring at that. I'm not gonna move. I'm not gonna do this. I'm not gonna look down at my mouthpiece. I know it's in my hands. I'm gonna fix my head and my eyes are gonna do the job. It's gonna make my head stay in one spot because my eyes are the boss. I'm looking there and I'm gonna put the mouthpiece right out in front of me and I'm gonna, don't look at it, stay looking at the object. You can sort of see it in your view, side view, but don't, don't do that. Look at it and now look at my elbow. My elbow's about 45 degrees, it's like it's sitting on a desk. It's not out here, it's not in here. Okay, here I go again, straight ahead out and it's coming in 
and I'm gonna put my other hand on my face and make that T-I-U face. Q, T, T. And I'm pushing a lot of air. Do this, take your finger, lick it, stick it way out in front of you. I'm pushing hard from down here, not up here in my shoulders, down here. That's where you wanna breathe from. And it's gonna be like this. I think I drilled there a little bit. Sorry guys. Okay. You want to keep your air going. It's as if you throw a stone and the stone just keeps on going. You don't want it trailing off like this. You don't want. Here's that in the horn. That's not going to work down the horn. It has to be a steady stream and it has to keep going for as long as you want to play that note. You're going to build up some lung capacity here but it's down here, down in your diaphragm area that you're gonna breathe from. Now do this, stick your hand on your stomach, okay? And I want you to take a breath, but make your stomach go out. That doesn't feel normal, okay? You kind of like, oh, okay? We don't normally breathe like that. If you're laying down, you kind of do, but when we're sitting, we more shoulders up it like that, okay? We don't wanna do that. A deep breath like that. Okay, so let's do this together. You're gonna to take the mouthpiece in your hands. Don't look at it. Look up at some spot, fix it. Fix your eyes right on that spot. Mouthpiece comes out in front of you. You're sitting like you could stand up. Elbows at 45 degrees. Put it to your face. Put your other hand there. T-I-U face. T -U -T -U. You need to try that as well. Now I'm gonna stop the video here for you and give you a chance to do that with your teacher. And I'm gonna come back in a moment here and talk about some sounds that you may have been making. And then we're gonna give you a chance to say, oh yeah, that's my sound and now I know how to fix it. So you go ahead with your teacher.